Welcome guys, we are here to root Xperia C5 Ultra and install Exposed framework in it. First of all, we see the model and Android version. It's an Indian model, E5563, Android version 5.1. But you can install it any model number. So, here we go. First of all, we need to root our device. I already have everything. I just told you how to do it. Use King Root 4.8.0 to root your device. Try two or three times to root. It's a unsuccessful, but uh, you need to try. But then your device will root. So I have root access. Then. Google Play Store download busybox I already have open it and there is an install so install it I already installed it so I don't need then terminal emulator you need uh, terminal emulator install it When you install BusyBox, install it like like this and install. You need to restart your device. Then then we have these we need some files so we go there go to the link I provide so paste it page 3 remember page 3 Go down, go down, go down, and there it is. First of all, expose installer 3.0 alpha.apk. You need apk file, expose installer. So, you can get it from here. There it is. Download it. Post framework file, so you need to download it. Only zip file. Expose V80 SDK 2264. Only this file. Download it. I already have, so I don't need. Then install it on bin file from there. There it is. Download. And uh, a common camera APK file for fix your camera bug. There it is. Yeah. Now we have all files and close it. Go to file manager. We have common camera dot install dot pen SDK zip file SDK APK file install APK file first. Install it but do not run it. Do don't know do not open it. Installer dot bin and zip file copy. Copy both files into internal storage, not in any folder like this as you see. Installer dot bin. Expose BAT SDK 22 ARM 64.7. Both are there. Now close. Uh, go to terminal emulator. Small alphabets. Type SU. 
you have no taxes allowed then type as such space slash sd card slash installer.bin it's open like this as you see one for yes and no for two then you type one and do it uh, one more time it says type one or two for no so use one you can see but it's type already so do it I already have so I don't have to do it when it finish then close it and go and reboot your device once once you reboot your device it takes some time I mean a lot of time so don't worry about it so then when you install it then you can see framework your framework is version it is active then good now we have to fix our camera so we need root explorer copy camera camera common app again copy it and paste it into root system private app camera common use this name in apk paste it over right here then your camera will work i will show you Now it's done everything. Now enjoy.